Islamic State militants have killed at least 24 members of the Kurdish security forces in a surprise attack in northern Iraq, Kurdish officials said, in one of the deadliest single battles for the Kurds since last summer. Three Kurdish officers reported continued clashes with Islamic State today, one day after the deaths, near Gwur, a town some 40 kilometers southwest of the autonomous Kurdish region's capital Arbil. Kurdish-controlled war is likely to be a launch pad for any future attempt by Iraqi and Kurdish forces to retake Mosul, the biggest city in northern Iraq which Islamic State seized last June. Islamic State militants crossed the river Zab in small boats on Friday night and entered Gwur, but were driven back by Kurdish Peshmerga forces, the officers said. We've been engaged in fighting with them for the past two days, said one senior Kurdish officer on the Gwur front line as the sound of gunfire rattled in the background. The officer, who asked to remain anonymous, said around 60 militants in total had been killed in that by intercepting the frequency they used to communicate via walkie-talkie and listening in. It appeared many more were injured. Both he and another officer blamed the Iraqi army for allowing the militants to reach war. They accused Iraqi sodders of abandoning a forward position when they came under attack, leaving the town exposed. Please subscribe the video.